the United States shot down a Chinese spy balloon off of the east coast of the United States. Marjorie Taylor Greene has said that this has been done with Jewish space lasers, but that has not been confirmed. However, this occurs in the context of increasing talk about war with, between the U.S. and China. About a week ago, a four-star Air Force general predicted, I don't quite know what that means, that we will be at war with China within five years. Mike Pompeo, the former Secretary of State, who was probably one of the five leading candidates for the Republican nomination for president, is essentially running on the platform of let's go to war with China. And both parties are increasingly hawkish on the prospect of war with China. However, war with China is not inevitable. And smart policymakers from both sides of the aisle should recognize that a top foreign policy priority of the United States is to avoid a war with China. Because what is inevitable is that if we actually have a war with China, it will be devastating in so many ways, not just to the US, not just to China, but to the whole world. So although saber rattling always makes politicians feel good and maybe even helps them win elections, this is not the time for that. This is a time to figure out how to pursue our goals and our interests while avoiding war with China.